Alleyways are always filled with doors, many of which never seem to lead anywhere. Once in a while, you may find a door that seems completely out of place and out of time. These old wooden doors look like they could be centuries old and have very delicate and ornate designs carved into them. These are the one-way doors. Now one day, you might find yourself down an alley, staring at one of these mysterious doors, overcome with curiosity. You approach the door and test the copper doorknob. Surprised to find that the door has been left open, you swing the door open slowly, finding that it's extremely dark. Despite it being rather bright in the alley, you're unable to see anything past the doorway. Still bugged by the possibility of what lies beyond the door, you go against your better judgment and step into the pitch darkness. You blink a few times, allowing your eyes to adjust to the brightness, and you realize that you're standing back in the alley, facing the door. You try the door knock again, except that this time it's locked. The last thing you remember doing is going through this old wooden door, except now, you're standing back out in the alley. You shrug it off as some memory lapse or deja vu moment. And seeing as the door was now locked, you decide to head home. As you turn around, you see a man heading towards the door, clearly just as curious about the door as you are. Don't bother, bro. It's locked, you tell him. He doesn't mind you and keeps walking towards the door, going straight through you. Wait, what the fuck? You stare wide-eyed as the man continues to make his way towards the door. How did he? Is that guy a ghost? Unless I'm the... The man reaches for the doorknob and opens the door. He pokes his head into the darkness before fully stepping through the doorway. As the man steps into the room, his foot doesn't find any ground. He falls 30 feet down to the bottom of the pit inside the room. He dies the instant he hits the pile of dead bodies at the bottom of the pit. His body lies neatly next to yours.